So a reef knot is one of the most secure knots you can get. So you take your two ends of your string and we want to go right over left and under. So right over left and under. So I go under that string. Okay, you can make your strings a wee bit longer. And then we want to go left over right and through. So it's kind of the opposite. Left goes over the top of the right string, comes under and through. There we go. If I hold this up, hopefully you should see, I've got kind of two hoops that do that. And when they pull together, that is a really, really tight knot that will not come undone unless you actually snap the string. Second kind of knot is a lasso knot, which is really quite smart, okay? I want to take two ends and I want to make it into a loop. So if I bring my fingers together, the rope or string will naturally go into a loop. Holding that loop with one hand, I'm gonna take this piece Pull it over so uh, it's right across the hoop. And then here comes the delicate bit. I've got to push it up and through, like this. Okay. I don't know about you, I think it looks a bit like a paper clip now. Now, I'm very careful if I just pull this tight. Okay. You'll see I've got a kind of a, a lasso thing. And actually, I can make that bigger or I can make it smaller. So if I was to put it over a container, for example, like that, pull it tight. There we go, got it. Final thing to show you is lashing. Now, usually when you lash two things together, like if you're making a raft or a shelter, you would use what's called a clove hitch at the start, but you can just tie any knot that you want to. The main thing with lashing is you always need to hold the string tight. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go under the orange, over the green, under the orange, over the green. Maybe a bit tricky on camera, but let's see if I can do it. Okay, so we're gonna go under the orange, over the green, mm. under the orange, I told you it'd be tricky on camera to do it, and over the green. So I'm starting to look a little bit like this. Hopefully you can see now that I've continued to do that, that's actually lashed those two bits, uh, those two pencils together really tightly.